I'm so ready to tackle this week ahead and really get back on top of things. I'm ready to focus on me and the things that I need to do instead of focusing on others and situations that no longer serve me. I'm tired of playing the waiting game, where we're waiting for a certain situation to play out and we're stagnant until it does. I want to live my life and not wait around for moments that I think will propel me forward. Instead, propelling myself forward and doing the things that make me feel alive and more like myself these days. I think that can be applied to a lot of things in my life too. I want more of a set it and forget it mentality. Like, instead of waiting for a response or a text or an email or even a payment, just to put it out there and to keep moving with your life instead of waiting to see what will happen. Live life and let things come back to you when you least expect it. It's such a simple concept, and yet we live every moment of our lives worried and stressed about a scenario that hasn't even played out yet instead of trusting the process. Why do we feel like we constantly need to worry or think about a situation as if it will give us more control? God already has laid the foundation to how things will play out in our lives. That's the crazy part. Our lives have already been mapped out. All we have to do is keep living a purposeful life and do God's work here on earth. We have an easy job when you think about it. It's our mind that makes things more complicated than they need to be. I want to challenge myself to get out of my mind and be more of the woman that God has created me to be with no hesitation. I want to hold myself accountable and align more with the higher version of myself and do what she would do and carry herself in a way that she would carry herself. My last year of my 20s feels so surreal. There are so many things I want to accomplish, so many things I thought I would have by now, but I'm learning to give myself the grace and space to still be evolving and grow into myself. So to the last year of my 20s, let's make this one count.